Huh, that was kind of awkward. I just realized I was talking for like a pretty long time and no one could hear me. Jeez, all that wasted effort. All of those hilarious jokes about skeletons completely ruined. Damn. I really fucked up, guys. <laughs> we could hear you fapping. Uh oh. Was it the skeleton porn, or was it, um... Was it the skeleton porn you guys saw, or the pterodactyl porn? I think the pterodactyl porn was a little bit randy. The best part about the pterodactyl porn is when the director says, he's, like, giving him pro tips, he's like, Flap your wings more! Flap your wings more, guys! Hey everybody, we join the stream assuming having commentary means commentary for someone that is difficult to carry. <laughs> Not there will be a lot of commentary. Thanks, dude. Frank can't play you guys. I'm gonna stack at the moment. Oh, my favorite man, baby. Spider porn. No, I haven't seen spider porn. I don't even know how spiders mate. My understanding is that spiders have vaginas, but I could be wrong. At least that was my assumption. I'm gonna look up some spider porn, because now I'm extremely interested in hearing how spiders make the spider babies. Let's see. Huntsman spiders mating. The native is called a Mang Moon. Alright, fuck it. You guys are gonna see some nasty shit. This is actually music pulled directly from pornos in the 70s, guys. With their flat bodies, these sit and wait hun hunters are able to hide in narrow cracks between stones and stay there for most of the time. Well, I like where this is going. Oh, jeez, that's the money shot right there. But this is no ordinary drag line. It has been placed by a mature female and is loaded with pheromones. And they do not go unnoticed. For the male, they act as guidelines to the female, which he follows carefully. But he is not the only one who is looking for a mate tonight. The trick is to let the female know he is a potential mate, and not a snack. This one is actually lucky that all she does is leave. Huntsman spiders have a peculiar way of letting the female know what they have in mind. They use a combination of humming and waving that is unique to every species. Oh, sorry, I'll post the link in chat in case you guys want to watch it on your own, by the way. The lights dim and such. There you are. I think this is where shit goes fucking down. Ooh. Now that she's seduced, it is safe for him to try and mount her. I have no idea he what I'm looking at here. He charged his pulse with sperm and is now trying to transfer it into her epigenome. To do so, he has to inflate a balloon-like structure to inject the sperm out of his copulatory organ. I really have no idea what I'm watching, but I guess this is how spiders made. Some kind of mouth balloon to spider poon. It's tough to say. It's really beautiful, guys. It's the power of nature. <laughs> Look at those eyes. And for too long, she decides to be on her way. A Wait. month later, the female will be. Well, hold on. Did the male like die or something? She's hesitating for too long. 
She decides to be on her way. Oh, that's fucked up. He just got blue ball. Later, the female will build a silken pocket inside of which the young spiders will hatch. She will guard and carry around this cocoon until her offspring emerge from it in five to six weeks. The best part is how she just kind of drags him with her when he gives up. You can feel like the despair in the spider, like he knows he's fucking failed. This is how human mating works too, guys. If you take too long, they just sort of walk away. Well, I feel like I learned something Inside today. Of which the young spiders will hatch. So we'll go I had no idea how spider mouth dicks worked. People from Peru have a Peru something. He knows he's failed? He's dead? Did he actually die? Couldn't tell. But he's so disappointed. I want to see the hairy, giant hairy spider cut. She was chilling on him, so I assume he's dead. I proceeded to drag his lifeless corpse away. Whoa, Anaclitus. Are you too cool for school now that you're a pro gamer? All pick. This is where I random if I get a shit here I just repick. Okay, I'll swap you. There we go. What do you want? I always end up repicking when I get a shit hero. Just like every game. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. Here, call, pause it and call a hero for me to pick for swaps, guys. I can't think on my own. Prepare for battle. This time it is the demon who will do the summoning. Yes. end up with these same items. Yes. We could. 30 seconds yes. to What's up, dude? Oh, 
Hello, good sir. Oh, I know. Disrupt them right after Gale so that I completely fuck up the gank. Yep, exactly. The battle begins. I just got hate spiked. It's probably a jungle Ursa, unless he really likes Rings of Regen. Yo, Arnie, you wanna just like run at that Ursa level 1? Yeah. Dude, you don't even have to ask. Here, I'll lead with the disrupt, because I'm that good. I bet this fat son is farming this small camp with his ring of regen. What a pussy. Yes. Yeah, a real man would start at the hard camp. You missed, bro! You missed your auto attack up the hill! Alright, who's gonna get it? Let's take some bets. Take some bets. I think it's me. I think that's me. Nope, get fucked, noob. Biggest YOLO disrupt and oh shit, this is the worst word I've ever placed. Oh, I did. I'm just three good for you. Want to just back up, smoke, and then walk it mid or Ursa? Right up here. I'm gonna leech level two. I don't think we're gonna kill Blue either, but we're gonna find someone. He's gonna get sad. I'll just disrupt. Hmm, maybe not. Jeez, this is dendy. This is terrifying me, man. Wait, what the fuck? Did this guy just try to kill? RSF's dominating top, so... Yeah, the guy's in there, but we can't really do anything about that. We can try to deal with this, though. Oh. Fuck him, I'm killing his satyr. Just come back and wait for him to kill the small camp. It's almost spawned. So I gather. Do you think he'll do it? The trap is set. SF is crushing Marana. Radiance courier has been killed. This guy probably thought his two supports were gonna help him. Boy, was he wrong? This is kind of hard though, because like the bottom and the Slark are scary to kill. Because they do like sick nasty jumps, like Jamaicans. I thought that was like Kenyan the jump. No, they're the runners, never mind. Yeah, they're the runners, but I guess they're both runners. I'm gonna buy some gear. Here, have some tangos. It was a tango delivery for me and my fucking Venomancer. Oh, dude, he killed your fucking branch. You gonna take it like a bitch? Yes. 
accomplishing so little with our fucking realm. I'm gonna disrupt first. Oh, never mind. This is a really good trap, though. I'm gonna lead with disrupt. That was a good reaction from the bottom. A little bit of farm as a support is never like a bad thing. Support can be really fun to play if you're playing with people that are like good because you can always just like accomplish shit on the map. But here I'm not really accomplishing anything, so that's different. Spot right now. Do you need me to come hold your hand? Okay, I'm not really accomplishing anything, so. Three lanes of enemy tower. Okay, I failed to stack this before. If that was a triple stack, it would have at least made my time somewhat useful for my SF. What kind of Indian? Like smallpox Indian or? Your middle tower is under attack. Pussy doesn't want to man up and fight you. No. What more stuff? Buying out when you're losing is usually not a very good proposition. The enemy's 
top tower has fallen. <laughs> so ring with a fucking man. He wants to be able to always put mana to go. Now, now. Nick or Sark is around top, but I don't know where Nyx is. It's a level six Nyx too. Oh god, I'm so sorry. Oh, okay. 